Hey guys, so this is going to be today's message. So I'm going to use the African Rising Goddess deck to see what message we have for today. So let me shuffle real quick. Um, if you guys haven't already, please make sure you like, you comment, and you subscribe to the channel. Your like and your comment goes a long way, but your subscription goes even further. We are a small channel trying to grow, so we will love your support. Um, well, let's see. What is the message for the day, Spirit? What do we need to know? Ooh, surrender. I set Isis. She's all about surrendering. So I feel like when this card comes out, it kind of asks you, like, what do you need to surrender to? You know, like, I feel like a lot of times we go back and forth with things. We're trying to figure out um, what's important to us. We're fighting for things. And, like, you know, to no avail, nothing is happening, right? We could be fighting for a love. We could be fighting for a job. We could be fighting for happiness. But the key about it is just, like, letting go. Are you able to let go? Are you able to surrender to the universe, to God, to your spirit guides, to your ancestors, and allow the knowledge to come in so you can actually grow? You know, like we want, we want everything so quickly. We want everything right now. We want everything. We want everything. We want everything, right? We got to have it as of yesterday. We are the as of yesterday community uh, or society. And it's not about as of yesterday, you know, because if it was up to me, my channel would be a million subscribers or um, I'll be a millionaire, you know, like, and I will be helping people grow um, all around the world, right? But because it's a process, and I'm just using me as an example, because it's a process, I have to go through the journey and I have to have the hiccups along the way. And I have to understand that I need to surrender to the universe just for me to get what I want, right? And so this is your time to really just like surrender, figure out what it is you want, but let go. Let go and let God. I know y'all heard that saying, let go and let God. So I'm going to read what she means, right? So God is I set is revered as the magical healer or sorceress. She of 10,000 names. You may know her as Isis. Her Greek name is Aset, Aset, Wuset, Aset, Iset, and uh, was worshiped in ancient Nubia, e uh, the Egypt and beyond. So when you get this card, it says, let it all go. I just said that. It says, say out loud now, I surrender. These words cast a spell, breathe them in, release control, stop bonding around struggle, hand the keys to the divine, allow spirit to carry you and, um, and fill in the gaps. You don't have to figure it all out, goddess or goddesses, um, God or goddesses has your back. Have faith in where you are at this moment. And a declaration or affirmation for today is... Everything I need to know finds me at the perfect time. So surrender is the message. Let it go. Like I say, if it's a relationship that you're holding on to or a friendship that you're holding on to and it's just not serving you and you're finding yourself in more pain than anything, you're going to have to find a way to let it go. Just like a job, you know. You may want to say, oh, I need my money, blah, blah, blah. But are you really trusting the universe? Are you really trusting God to actually bring you these things to you? Because you're more caught up on, oh, this is the only thing. This is my only blessing, right? But God has so many blessings for you. You don't have to fight. You don't have to, like, um, chase. You attract. And that's what you have to understand. You definitely attract the things that are good for you. But anyway, guys, this is the message I have for you today. I hope that this resonates for you. If it does, give me a like <laughs> or comment or even subscribe to the channel. But thank you, guys. Bye.